Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and join us as part of this growing community. Wifey here. As always, these videos are for educational purposes only. We are sharing our lives and teaching people about the joys of a real female-led relationship. Now, hubby had a birthday the other day. Yes, of course he got a birthday spanking. And yes, of course, I made it count. I think he's still feeling that one to grow on, if you know what I mean. I even threw him a little party with a few friends. Unfortunately, that may have been a mistake since he could not control himself and started acting like a fool. I gave him my signature. You better calm down, look. And I know he got the message, but do you think he calmed down? Absolutely not. I held up a finger in a way that only he could see, indicating he was already in trouble, but that it was just a first level amount of trouble. Do you think that caused him to rethink his behavior? Absolutely not. I didn't think he drank enough to be this stupid, so I thought I would give him a chance to straighten himself out. I calmly asked him to help me in the kitchen where I could get him away from everyone for a moment. I told him in no uncertain terms that he better straighten up and act right or else. He looked so sheepish that I thought that would be the end of it. I didn't know how wrong I was. We made a couple of snacks for the guests and he served them, but before I even sat down, he was being loud and crazy again with his friend. I cleared my throat and shot him a glance. Now, mind you, if we had been alone and he ignored my warning in this way, I would have grabbed him immediately and let him know how I felt. His butt would still be burning. As it was, I kept my calm and held up three fingers in a gesture that only he knows about. That got his attention and he corrected his course. Unfortunately for him, it was already too late. A three is past the warning stage. The night wore on and everyone left. Overall, a beautiful birthday party. Friends, fun, everything you could want if you ignore the fact that hubby had been ignoring my warnings to calm down and be dignified. He sometimes gets so excited, and I love it when he does, but not when he goes too far. Once the guests were gone, he cleaned up the mess and was about to go to bed. He thought he was in the clear. I pulled him aside as he was brushing his teeth. I asked him why he ignored my rules and warnings, and he looked perplexed. I know when he's trying to act innocent, and this was definitely his way of trying to get out of it. I picked up the hairbrush that sits on the sink and showed it to him. He got nervous, since I know he hates this one. I looked at it and began brushing my hair before sitting it back down. You're grounded from the internet for four days, I told him. He looked shocked. He could only use his computer and phone for work. He picked the brush up and begged me to use it instead. I stood firm. No, you're grounded, I said. I could tell this punishment was going to be effective. I knew the birthday spanking had left a bit of an impression on him in a fun way. That really was a fun spanking to give, honestly. But I wanted him to know I was not pleased with his behavior during the party. Grounding him from the internet prevents him from doing several things he loves. I know he loves responding to messages here. I know he loves his Facebook and Reddit time. But no, he is allowed none of that. So his grounding is almost over, and he has been a very obedient hubby the entire time. The message got through. I am actually glad I chose this way to handle this because it gave me a chance to work directly with our channel and to talk to the community. And I must say, I see why he worked so hard to convince me that we needed to start this channel. Y'all are amazing, and it's so much fun to talk back and forth, get new ideas, and share a piece of our lives with all of you. All in all, I'm actually glad I have a willful hubby who will sometimes push my buttons. If he was perfect, I wouldn't have learned about all of you, and I wouldn't be taking a more active role in the channel. I would have just talked with him and let him do most of the work. I never would have known how great this is. All of this is due to his being just a bit rowdy at a birthday party. He was so upset at being grounded that he was afraid all of the people responding would think we were ignoring him so I had agreed to respond and do the best I could. I never expected to love it as much as I have. So from now on, Hubby and I will be sharing the responsibility of responding and making videos. I know he has told you that I cannot use my real voice or my image due to my career, so I hope you understand, but I wanna to continue to be an active part of this community, and I hope you will all be as welcoming as you have been so far. Thank you again, and have a wonderful day.